I want to share a personal story with you guys. So my daughter comes home from school and she's crying. She's depressed. She's upset. She says, Dad, I'm a failure. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not good enough. I don't think I can ever achieve what they're expecting of me in school. I said, Chloe, come here. Let's talk. What's going on? Well, I took my spelling test, Dad, and I got zero for 10. Well, what else happened? Well, then I took my math test, Dad, and I got one for 10, and I failed them both. See, Dad, I'm just not very good at spelling, and I'm just not very good at math. Well, the funny thing was, I started to reflect two days prior when we were home, and we started to put some pressure on her to study. And when she studied, we gave her the same test at home, and she passed it. So I said, Chloe, I want you to do something. And I know it's going to sound weird. She's only nine years old. But I want you to do is I'm going to write out some words and some phrases. And I want you to repeat them after me. No, Daddy, no, Daddy, I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. And she cried and she was upset. But I go, Chloe, I love you. I'm your dad. I will never ask you to do something that's not in your best interest. So reluctantly, she said, Daddy, I'll try it. So we wrote out, I'm beautiful. I'm brave. I'm smart. I'm intelligent. I can do it. I'm stronger than I know. And she started to repeat these things louder and louder. It started from tears to laughter to joy. My wife comes upstairs and says, what are you guys doing? And Chloe goes, I'm alive. I'm awake. I'm beautiful. I'm brave. I'm smart. I'm intelligent. I can do all things that people say I can because I am the best. I am a masterpiece and I am built and I was picked by my family because I am the best. And my wife started to participate. I started to participate. My daughter comes home from school the next day. and She goes, Daddy, I'm beautiful. I'm smart. I'm talented. And I passed both my tests, but nothing wrong. And I go, Chloe, what changed? And I know my daughter is nine years old. She's only nine. And she goes, Daddy, before I took the test, I reminded myself, and I did that thing you told me to do. She didn't know there were affirmations. She didn't know how to say that. But she said, Daddy, I told myself I'm beautiful. I'm brave, I'm smart, I can do this. And daddy, when I walked in there, I knew I could do it. So if my nine-year-old daughter can change her life and build up confidence by changing the word she uses, why can't you? Let's start changing the conversations we have with ourselves so we can work on ourselves to change our vibration because what you reflect to the world is what's inside. And that inside voice reflects and shifts out to the world. So what voice, what vibration are you sending the world? Love yourself. Until next time, keep on.